If the customer does not choose to redeem the vehicle and reinstate the loan, the next step that you're going to take is to accelerate the balance. What this is going to do is move the total balance due from just the delinquent amount to the full amount of the contract. So you're going to select the balance or balances that you need to include in this acceleration process and you'll click accelerate at the bottom of the screen. Once you do this, you'll get a pop-up message asking you to confirm that you do want to accelerate or that the contract has been accelerated. And now you can see the total balance due is the full loan amount. Now, if the customer, if it's still within the period of time between recovery of the vehicle and the sale date that you can take it to the auction, the customer still could redeem the vehicle and the amount they would have to pay for redemption would be the total past due plus any fees that are on the account because of the repossession. So that amount is approximated right here for you as well in the accelerate tab. If for some reason the customer did come in and want to redeem the vehicle, all you would need to do then is unaccelerate the note. So click unaccelerate and then say yes you want to unaccelerate it and then it'll tell you that the redemption will remove the acceleration invoice remove the bad debt flag and the out for repo flag reset the accelerated flag and then notes receivable will be updated so once you're ready then you can click yes notice that the process is not reversible back to the current status if you say yes so if you're ready to redeem, then unaccelerate and click yes. Otherwise, click no and you can continue with the repossession process.